see of Ibrox. And that's where we're returning back to today for the first time since the 14th of May. And funnily enough, our opponent then was Dundee as well. We've come out with a good victory then, scoring five goals. And hopefully our return to Ibrox is the same today. And we can manage to get past Dundee today and into the semi-final. And a competition that Clermont is very familiar with, having won it last year. And very important that for this squad, for the morale, that we're getting further in this competition and hopefully winning it. I just felt like I had to put that little compilation at the start of some of the best moments of atmosphere at Ibrox over the recent years and can't wait to get back there today. Not quite expecting the atmosphere to be the same as that. Of course, not the full Copeland Open today where the Rangers end is going to be. We've had all this stuff about the Union Bears moving over and making this, as it's called, the Rangers end. Not going to see that in full action today. Looking forward to that. And in fact, it doesn't look... Even though it's not going to be the full stadium available, it doesn't even look like it's going to be a sellout, which, hey, we'll see what it's like when we get there. But looking forward to get back there. Hope you feel like you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. <laughs> Good to be back. No place like home. Let the confusion begin of people trying to work out how to use the QR codes for this one. Good to be walking up these stairs again. And nice to hear the drums on this side of the stadium. This does just look weirdly quiet over there, Luke.
Irish TV, you may know what his nickname is Nana, but one call to the commentator on his own, so pronouncing this. Well, actually, you won't find out because the speakers here are shy. No tab on the pitch, deoting the Dessos keeps that form, moving into the semi-final as we are searching still to find consistency but that's a good performance today, Barron again really really good, Shefty today, unlucky for Yamas about when he did with that injury but Shefty is going from strength to strength and Yamas will have a very hard time trying to come back into this team now, still wasteful with a lot of stuff, I'd love to see us somehow try to fit Hamza and Dessos in the same team at the same time because Dessos hold up play has not been brilliant but Hamza seems to have that in abundance. What they, I feel like the two of them would really complement each other but today's one, it's a win, we're moving on, searching for consistency, hope you've enjoyed it, we'll see you in the next one.